Happy New Year. 2018 is here. We made it. 2017 was wild, filled, filled with ups and downs, a lot of grinding, uh, a lot of traveling actually, which was amazing. I hope I can keep that up in 2018. But um, I've got some New Year's resolutions that I want to talk to you about, things that I'm going to try to commit to uh, for the upcoming year that I feel like are going to provide significant value to my life. So here we go. One, uh, 10 minutes of meditation or prayer per day. Um, I recently read a book, Radical Acceptance, uh, actually it's right here, by Tara Brock. Um, incredible book about actually a lot of the teachings of Buddhism, uh, about being in the present moment, about in times when you have negative energy or you're stressed out or you're mad during the day, just pausing and being here and breathing and um, you know, since I started meditating daily, uh, I'm, I'm just much more calm, I'm, I'm more mentally focused. Uh, my ADD isn't running around. And so, you know, getting that, getting that time in that morning before I start my day has been incredibly valuable and I wanna commit to that in 2018. So, number two, read one book per month. Um, you know, going back to, to Radical Acceptance, uh, this book, uh, The War of Art, I'm reading a book called Perfectly Yourself right now. Um, I'm really big into personal development and I'm really big into trying to find ways and hacks uh, to, to live this life and, and be in business and be in coaching and, and try to navigate it more efficiently and more easily. You know, it's, it's about uh, working smarter, not harder. And, um, you know, I already talked about the impact radical acceptance has had in my life. Um, the war of art talking about resistance and, and being progressive and, and being self-aware and using those God-given abilities to pursue whatever it is that um, you're destined to do. And um, so reading a book per month is, is, is absolutely going to happen. And uh, I can't wait to see what the effects are here in 2018. Um, thirdly, if you know me, you know that I love chocolate, I love donuts, I love cake, uh, pancakes, all that stuff. I love sweets. And so I am going cold turkey. It's already started today. I haven't had any sweets yet today. Um, you know, and, and, and sweets, it's an addiction for me. You know, when I get done with a meal, I have to have a dessert. Um, you know, I'm always snacking. And, you know, I wouldn't say it's extreme because I train a lot and, you know, I, I'm somewhat moderate, but it, it is an issue. And so uh, I'm going cold turkey for the month of January and I'm gonna see where it takes me from there. Um, Reducing sugar, I, obviously I understand the incredibly negative effects that sugar have, has on your mental and physical health. And uh, I'm excited, I think my energy levels are gonna spike, I think I'm gonna get more lean, and you know, th those are two things that are very important to me. So, that is that. And number four, with Podium, help as many athletes and coaches sign contracts as possible. I want 500 signings through Podium in 2018. That's our goal and we're gonna hit it and do everything that we can to hit it. Um, you know, we wanna to continue to grow the sport of American football around the world. I am obsessed with the international football community. I'm obsessed with college football and I'm obsessed with helping guys get to the next level. And, um, and in 2018 with Podium, we're gonna build, we're gonna build upon the, the London Breakthrough Camp and we're gonna have a Podium College All-Star event in Miami. And then we're, we're gonna go to Europe and have six camps. We hope to get to Mexico, we hope to get to Brazil. We want to provide a platform both online and in person so that we can give guys the opportunity to get scouted and earn contracts and get to the highest level. So uh, 2018, I think, is really, really the breakout year for Podium. We've been grinding for the last two years to get to where we are now, but now the pieces are in place. We have the right people working for us. And um, you know, I think at our core and at our mission, that is the reason why we are going to exponentially grow because we are coming at it with a honest, loving perspective that Marcus and I are coming from. We were in those positions five years ago and we want to help guys earn contracts and experience what we got to experience. And those are the four resolutions uh, that I wanted to talk about today. I've got several more, but those are just for me. And uh, at the end of this year, if I, if I achieve them, when I achieve them, I'll be sure to announce them to everyone. But um, stay hungry. Continue to feel gratification for the life that we have and continue to pursue what's on your heart. Whether that's a career, whether it's a hobby, um, grow as a person each and every single day and make that a point of 2018. God bless you all. 2018 is gonna be the best year yet.
peace.